Hello, I'm Daniel with Palm Videos Tech Support. Okay. <clears throat> we do have an alternative to the DDNS client that comes with GeoVision. It's a free alternative. A lot of times this will say failure occurred. It's some, it just drops the names off the server. It's, it's nothing bad. Usually you can just re-register, but that can get kind of tiresome. So let's go ahead and check out this other great free service called DYNDNS. So you want to click on start, go to Internet Explorer, and then we'll go to DYNDNS.org. And then we'll click create account right under here. And let's see, Daniel at palmvid.com. Daniel at palmvid.com. Oops. I actually want to do this. Palmvid demo. And then type a password. Okay, we're going to uncheck newsletters. We don't want newsletters. And then we have to agree. I'm going to go ahead and create account. And then we should have an email in my email inbox. I'm going to go start Internet Explorer. And then go check my mail. Let's pump it. Let's see here. All right, we got DYDNS. Basically what we have to do is you have to check your email before you can activate the service. You have to click on the activation link for it to start working. Account confirmed. Okay, let's go ahead and log in. I'm gonna go ahead and choose to save my password. Okay, now we want to locate services. Dynamic DNS, the first one here. And then DDNS update clients. We're going to go ahead and download it now and choose run. And then we'll choose run again and click next. Agree. Show try show tray icon and start with windows. It's perfectly good. Go ahead and click next and then make a check mark next to install the DNS updater as a Windows service. Go ahead and click next and then install. And then run the DNS updater and click finish. All right. So, on the demo and my password. Click OK. And now we got updater status on. And then let's go ahead and minimize this. And we will go back to services. Dynamic DNS. And manage hosts. We'll go ahead and click the add new host name. And we'll do palmvid demo. And then we'll name this DVR DNS. The reason for this is because it technically is a DVR. And we'll want to check, click on this use auto detect IP address. And then leave that unchecked and go ahead and create host. All right. As you can see, it's zero dollars. Don't be scared. It's it's not charging you. Click the payment button, and then activate service. Now let's go ahead and close out of all these windows. Don't need them up. And oh, 
open up the DYDNS updater here and go refresh host list. I'll just place a check mark right there and then press apply. Okay, you'll notice it says DYN DNS returned good. Now, if we're using the DYDNS, we might as well go ahead and uninstall the DDNS client. So let's go ahead and exit out of it, choose yes, go to start, all programs, and then find the DDNS and uninstall. Now instead of going to username.ditmap.com, now we can just simply go to username.dvrdns.org. So http colon forward slash forward slash palmviddemo.dvrdns.org colon 81. And I'll bring it straight to our cameras. Go ahead and sign in for a test. Go ahead and save it. Uh oh, what's going on? Click. Oh, no, we got it. Video loss. Let's click refresh. Why it came up kind of funny. Ah, there it goes. Much better. All right, let's go ahead and exit out of here. And I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope it helps out. And please visit us at www.palmvid.com.